Hello guys, in this video I will show you how to construct an involute of a hexagon of side 50 mm. Hexagon means 6 sides and each side is of 50 mm. That is the question. So open the AutoCAD and first we need to draw a hexagon that is 6 sided polygon. So select a polygon and give the number of sides as 6. Once you give the number of sides as 6, press enter. Then it will ask specify center of the polygon. Don't go for center of the polygon since we know, you know the edge of it that is side of it. Press E enter. So press E and press enter. Then it will ask specify first end point. So give the first end point and it will ask specify the second end point. The second end point is at a distance of 50 mm that is given in the question. So 50 mm. So this is a hexagon of side 50 mm. If you have any doubt go here. Check it here from here to here check it it is a 50 mm so it is perfectly drawn so this is the hexagon of length 50 mm or the side 50 mm so once it is finished then uh, let me draw a straight line from this corner point like this of, a dis of the length perimeter of the hexagon so hexagon is of six sides and each side is 50 mm therefore perimeter is 6 into 50 that is 300 mm so 300 mm so i have drawn this straight line of length 300 mm because this is the perimeter and this is six sided and 50 each side so 300 mm now divide this line into six parts because it is six sided object so d i v that is the division command and press enter select this straight line and divide it into six segments this is how you should get if it is not coming then go for format point style and change the point style so that it will be looking to you as i have shown in the figure once this is finished you need to use array option and rotate this number of points and this side at all, each and every side or each and every point at these locations say this is a b c d e then each and every location you need to have this line along with these points so for that we can use polar array but we need to have the centroid of it for hexagon centroid option we need to draw straight line from here to here and another straight line from here to here so it will give you the center point that is p o enter this is the centroid point once it is obtained these two lines are not necessary i am selecting these two lines and i am deleting them now simply select all these things and give array that is polar array along this point so that at each and every point you will get all these points along with this side so now escape i have pressed then i have come out of all the commands then i am pressing polar uh, array that is array i am pressing and in this array polar array i am pressing it and select objects so selecting all these objects that is line and different points i'm selecting and press enter then it will ask a specified center point so i'm picking the center point this is the center point after that number of items it is asking hence it is a six sided object which i'm drawing here so i'm selecting six objects and angle to fill is 360 because along each and every side i want it so simply press ok at each and every location you got it so you can see this type of structure is updated so simply use polyline now go for polyline this is the 0th point this is the first point and on this the second point on this third point and on this fourth point on this fifth point and finally at this the end point that is sixth point you need to select once this is finished escape you press escape and select a PE enter PE that is poly edit enter then select the straight line and use fit option so that whatever the diagram or the involute you have drawn by using polyline is coming like a curve option so once this is done the extra things can be removed so I'm selecting everything and use trim option so at each and every location if I go for the trimming option whatever the unnecessary drawn objects are there it will be there so whatever the leftover points are all there those are also not necessary so you can select them and delete them as at a single glance so i have selected unnecessary points and i'm removing them so this is how the involute can be drawn hexagon by using simply array method so if you don't want to go for using the array method what you have to draw is you have to draw a straight line from this point to this point i'll show it to you by using another color here uh, escape press escape so i'm giving uh, some 
separate color so that you'll understand easily so from here to here i need to draw a straight line like this and what are this red color line i have drawn i used to use move option and from here to here i need to move so this is one thing after that again i need to draw a straight line from here to here then copy it select it center at this location and this location in it so this is one time and this is two times then delete it so this is two times now here you'll get three times here you'll get four times here you'll get five times here you'll get six times rather than doing it or repeating the copy command again and again and again simply you can use uh, this array option by drawing the straight line that is perimeter straight line and dividing it into number of equal parts that is here in this case six because it is a polygon of six sides we will go with number of points as six so that is how you can uh, draw them easily so by using array command it will be very easy for you so this is how you can finish the uh, involute of a hexagon